Well, good day to you wherever you are. You join us on a day where the weather just may have an impact on a football match that has been uh, much anticipated. It's dry at the moment, but the forecast is that it will be wet, perhaps very wet by the time the game is uh, underway and certainly by the time of the second half. The crowd, though, are here and they are in good form. There's a right old cacophony going on. The atmosphere is terrific and kickoff is moments away. It is a venue this which simply adds to the spectacle of the game it stages. One of the most impressive arenas in this part of the world. Tries to get it forward quickly. That's a promising ball. Oh, he's got a crucial block in there. Tries to locate someone up front. Phillips. Forward it goes. Sane. Hoists it forward. Great strength. Too strong for his opponent. Out to the right. Rodrigo goes long. Tries to get it forward quickly. Sonny! A tight old game so far. Can that change now? Sonny. Played into space out wide. Oh, that's nice. Jota. Jota gets it out to the wing. Phillips. Sane. And here's Rodrigo. Quick glance and shoots. Keeps everyone guessing. Turns and goes back. Has a hit. <laughs> oh, what a cracking goal. But a cracking touch as well. That's what made it for me. That's brilliant play all around. Leeds take the lead, landing the first significant blow in what is certainly a significant contest. That's what has to be done now, no question about it. Well, hit and hope is just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Spot on, Peter. And he's cut it out. Wolverhampton are actually displaying tremendous fighting spirit. There's a real belief that they can still have a say. Hoists it forward. Oh, he's in real chance! Wolverhampton are definitely not going down without a scrap. Their attitude just can't be faulted. Oh, that's neat. He's had it. He's good for it. Sticks it away. And that should do it. Within sight of the finish line. Simplicity itself.
Well, considering he has a bit of a, a shoot on sight policy, he was the one player that should have been picked up then. It was both careless and costly from Rowan City. So that's two now without reply. Adama Traore! <laughs> Dispatched clinically. Late drama, late goal. This will be one frantic ending. Perfect placement, the one place the keeper couldn't reach. Well, you know, sometimes it pays off not to think too much about things, just put your foot through it, and that was a good example. Great contact, and the keeper had very little chance. Wolverhampton give themselves a chance of a fairy tale finish. Oh, that's a waste. for them and maybe we can attribute that to a, to a loss of focus. Some help from Lady Luck there, they all count. Four extra minutes added on. With a delicate ball. Keeper's got good distance on that. Hoists it forward. Sade. Good ball, it's that Sonny! Goes direct to the front line. He's made sure that that won't get through. And there goes the final whistle. A decent win by a very competent performance. Without doubt, they were the better side, and the result reflects as much. And after all of that, Jim, what are you thinking? Well, it was engaging, if not...
Well, good day to you on a grey day here, which uh, promises rain, but promises way beyond that what should be a really good game of football. The stands are packed here. People have done everything they can to get here. They think the roads outside were pretty badly clogged, but I think most of the traffic issues have been settled. And indeed, I think most people have now got through the turnstiles and are well covered up against the elements, whatever they may throw at us over the next hour or two. The Emirates are washed with red and white, a sea of Arsenal, just as you would anticipate. Poveda. Anything, Jim, to pick out of these early exchanges? Well, both sides seem happy with the patient approach for now, still trying to have a good look at one another. It's anyone's ball. Mustafi demonstrating fabulous determination. He just will not be beaten. Jones. And it's been taken short. Ball driven towards the far post. Poveda leads so far, providing no real test at all for the goalkeeper. Sade. Rodrigo tries to stroke it through. They get a throw in. Good challenge. Excellent challenge. That's just an example of over committing, and they're fortunate for the quality of the intervention, it was vital. Tries to get it forward quickly. Oh, what? Sonny! And it's a goal! And that is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Well, I think two keepers would have had a hard time keeping that one out, never mind one. There was real venom in the strike and, and clear composure from the placement. Leads take the lead. Surprise, surprise. He just keeps on delivering, and listen, we all expect that. Leads settle for a point from that gripping game last time out. Sade. Cut out in the nick of time. It's a good run down the left hand side. He's gone for it! All the balls come loose! Phillips gets it as a pop! He's missed, but not by that far. A more than decent attempt, Peter. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. And it's Kolasinac. Could be a chance here. Shoots! Sticks it away! They have brought themselves an equaliser! Perfect placement. The one place the keeper couldn't reach. Now that's what I call finishing. Right in the corner. He knew instinctively who was there and didn't need to waste any time laying things up. That's a cracking goal.
So, time for changes on both sides, actually. Arsenal grab the equaliser, and we're all square. Well, the big question now is whether they can keep the energy levels up and try and grab a winner. Leeds showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. Granit Xhaka. And it's played forward. Uh, ball needed to be better there. It's a wasted chance. Sade. Klich. He's had a go! Oh, it's in! And that may just do it! He was really quick to react to the initial save, and he has his reward. Oh, look, there's only one player who merits all the praise for that. Not only did he finish it, but his instincts for being where he was are absolutely top-notch. Leads take what looks to be a decisive lead. Well, look, Peter, I feel I've got to stress that there's still time for another, so we can't be too presumptuous yet. Granit Xhaka. Torreira. Torreira drives it forward. Sade. And there goes the final whistle. Leads goes by the odd goal. Really could have gone either way, but a win is a win. So a dramatic game decided in its very last moments. Well, this looked like it had a, a draw written all over it, Peter, so credit where it's due. They found a way to win it, and they can take great satisfaction from uh, never losing that focus. Well, good day to you on a grey day here, which uh, promises rain, but promises way beyond that what should be a really good game of football. The stands are packed here, people have done everything they can to get here. They think the roads outside were pretty badly clogged, but I think most of the traffic issues have been settled, and indeed I think most people have now got through the turnstiles and are well covered up against the elements, whatever they may throw at us over the next hour or two so what a stage for the players to take to here ahead of such an important game the action has already started
Cahill tries to clear. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal, and he didn't go for the back heel. Oh, he's caught in there, it's a free kick. Well, that's a booking, always looked it. Gorgeous control there. Good defending, albeit from an unexpected source. You have to admire commitment like that, because he could easily ignore that and just kind of walk around and let others do all the chasing, but instead, he looks as if he relishes the chance to, uh, to dig in for his team here. And here's Rodrigo. Oh, really good feet from him. Well, the crowd clearly liked what they just saw. Some real no-nonsense defending. And it's Rodrigo. Piate gets his foot in there. Forward it goes. Just brushed off the ball there. Oh, that is lovely footwork. Alioski continues his run. So who's he picking out? Last ditch defending, but that'll do. He's come loose. Sade. He's good for it. Oh, that's a fine save. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Phillips. Is there any support? Has a hit! Taken with style. Well, if ever there was a perfect time to score, I think we just witnessed it. The lightness of step, the sharpness of movement, the certainty of finish. That's always a great sight, you know, on a football pitch. Nimble footage, so great balance and a really cool head to finish. And that kind of dribble is really smart. Ah, oh, now some movement on the bench, and we are going to see a change. Yeah, it's pretty obvious as to who was going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag, and he was never going to last until the final whistle. Leeds get themselves into the lead. Surprise, surprise. He just keeps on delivering, and listen, we all expect that. Referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. What a game. End to end, it flew by, and in the end, it all came down to just the odd goal. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim? Of course, we all love to watch the creative side of the game and goal scorers, but there's an art to good defence too, and their organisation and discipline has helped earn this win. And before we go...
Well, a very warm welcome to you on this most pleasantly clear evening. Conditions absolutely beautiful. Perfect for the beautiful game. Temperatures are kind as well. No doubt playing a hand in high attendance levels as well as an elevated level of anticipation here. Surely this is the hot ticket going around in this neck of the woods. It surely must be. It is a venue this which simply adds to the spectacle of the game it stages. One of the most impressive arenas in this part of the world. Southampton, whose manager came in for a bit of flack after their previous result. I think tactically he didn't make a good job of things for starters and then compounded matters in trying to correct it. I only hope he sticks in. Sare. Lovely bit of skill there. Hits one! It's there! there is the breakthrough! Well, it was a hefty deflection, but he's claiming it. Southampton draw first blood here. Well, listen, a few words of advice and encouragement for the manager during the break can often straighten things out. And it's paid off here. Sade. It's the through ball. Real chance! A real chance and a real let off. Now as good a time as any to pull level. This certainly looks appetising, well within shooting range. That's what has to be done now, no question about it. Jim, there's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this. Sonny! Well, get that clear. Alioski gets it back. Sonny. to meet it oh, not the best of headers oh, good play all round he was well hustled and, and still got a shot away oh that's nice has a goal oh taken with style And that is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Well, I think two keepers would have had a hard time keeping that one out, never mind one. There was real venom in the strike and, and clear composure from the placement. Leads, grab the equaliser, and we're all square. Well, that goal just serves to give them the momentum and psychological edge now at this stage, but for me, they've got to chase a winner. Oh. It's official showing that there will be three minutes of added time. This is gone, that's a foul. Sade. He's played him through. The referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. Passion and panache and perseverance and in the end parity. A really good game to watch.
How do you look back on the game then, Jim? Leeds can always take more positives from a result like this.